vlogging again. I feel like I just vlogged, it's, it was what, three days ago the last time I vlogged. Thought I would do a little bit more of a structured weekend vlog. I'm try, gonna try and get myself to actually vlog all weekend. So it's Friday today, about 10 o'clock. We've been up for quite a few hours. Actually got a good amount of work done today and decided I just need to go to the gym. I'm feeling a little bit overwhelmed this morning, a little overstimulated, which is nothing new, but I know that the gym will make me feel better. And there's a lot of days where I, I don't really get the chance to go just because I have shoots or appointments or whatever. So on a day where I don't really have anything planned, I think I have to take those opportunities to go to the gym. Let's go. Last time I went was a few days ago, like in my last vlog, it was freezing. And today it is 60 degrees. It's still a little windy, a little overcast. It's not perfect, but it's a whole lot better than it was last time we went. So I'm already in a much better mood going to the gym. Yesterday I sat outside on our back little patio and read a book while uh, Jaden was sleeping. I just had like the monitor by me and it was so warm and sunny and I literally sat out there for for hours his entire nap it was the best thing ever reading the next book in the fourth wing series I'm on iron flame and so far I really like it I've heard like mixed reviews on the second one but I like it I'm about a hundred pages in so anyways uh let's go to the gym I even got a spot right out front today would have preferred this spot when it was 15 degrees outside we're gonna go get a good workout in i feel like i had the worst road rage on the way here so um this is why i go to the gym to get anger out we've got oh hi you waving the camera are you waving we have a bit of a crabby boy on our hands i had a decent gym session it actually wasn't very busy um i don't know if it was because it was friday or the timing i went or what um but it was great i actually felt like i had my pick of machines i wanted the squat rack i wanted everything and the last time i went to the gym i was like so irritated because it was so busy <laughs> the only thing is that the um guy who works the front desk he's such a sweetie and i talk to him every time I go to the gym but I talked to him for a little bit too long so probably took up a good 20 minutes of my workout and Jaden can be at the daycare for like two hours but he doesn't last that long usually at about that 45 minute mark he is not doing so great so I kind of had to cut my workout short and go get him and when I got there they're like yeah he is like not very happy I think he's teething I'm like yeah story of our lives i'm gonna let him have a nice little snack and then lay him down for another nap and i might read outside for just a little bit it's not nearly as nice as it was yesterday but i just oh my goodness okay Alrighty. righty i'm gonna focus on him uh i'll catch up with the guys in a little bit just got a little amazon package so i got some little cups for Jaden. <laughs> these are so cute I wanted to get him little straw cups and I bought one, but um, the straw is like really hard to suck out of. So I thought I'd try this instead. And then I didn't really think about this, but it's obviously like a nice little cup. Well, in the meantime, I also bought little cups so that he can practice like drinking out of a normal cup. Oh, these are a little smaller. <laughs> the colors are so cute. So they're all just like silicone, but like how cute is that little cup? That's literally so cute. Another little straw one. Let's see what else we got in here. Ooh, wait. Okay, so this is either gonna be coffee pods, which I did need. Yep, that's what this is. But I also ordered um, the whole Akatar series because I know that when I'm done with Iron Flame, the fourth wing series i know that i'm gonna want to read avatar so i bought the whole thing the last order i placed for some nespresso coffee pods i accidentally got like the vanilla flavored ones and uh they do not taste good like i i made my coffee the first day i was like did i make something wrong like did i put too much syrup or what um no realize i bought the wrong one they're just they're not good at all i just got some classic starbucks pike place the little big pod so it makes like a full cup of coffee i honestly am tempted to have a cup of coffee but i already had two today so uh probably are not gonna do that and my little container of coffee pods the pods 
definitely aren't cheap but i think all the green ones i just got i think it was like 50 or 40 because i think it's like 10 dollars for a box which is not cheap but it's cheaper than going to buy a real coffee from starbucks and i truthfully feel like making a hot coffee in the morning with these i actually like a lot better than a starbucks coffee and i'm not just saying that iced might be a different story but the baby's up i think i'm going to attempt a walk around the block um which i'm sure you're thinking is like wow that's not hard i'm going to try and wear him and walk our dog so i haven't done that i literally have never done that because frazier our dog pulls a little bit and i'm like terrified of him pulling me while i'm carrying a baby but i think we can do it i think i'm i'm he's pretty secure to me i can have a pretty good hold on frazier and i think we're gonna try it because it's nice outside and i think it'd be good for all of us to be outside for a little bit Jaden pulled my braid out. Oh, my camera's so crooked right now. Anyways, so I just have this nice strand. But when we're done with this walk, I'm gonna shower and like actually get ready for the day. No sense in doing it before. Uh, yeah. I don't think we need like a real coat, but I am gonna wear, I think I'm gonna wear like a winter coat over me and kind of zip it. Uh. So it's like around him too. That's what we've been doing the last couple times and it seems to work. Stop. It's okay. Okay, I feel like I could see. Okay, I think his hips look good. He's pretty bundled against me, but I'm definitely gonna wear a coat just because I don't want him to be too cold. We're gonna test out our new little straw cup. He doesn't know straws, but I'm hoping it's easier. You wanna try it? You yeah, did you get any water? See, that's the hard part about it not being like see-throughs. You like have zero idea if they got any water. All right, I don't think you're getting anything. Let's try a trick. <laughs> this is so gross. I'm gonna put some free range chicken on his little straw and see if this works. Okay, let's try it now. Did you get any water? I don't think so. Try one more time. Yeah. It's the most gorgeous morning and I am heading to the Badlands to shoot my second senior session of the year. First one at the Badlands. Uh, it's 35 degrees but it's supposed to be like 50s or 60s today and I'm so excited. It's a Saturday so DJ's at home with Jaden and I just get a nice long drive and uh, a fun little shoot and I've shot this girl before. She's fun. She's easy. Let's go. about 20 minutes until my session it's only 32 degrees here so it's definitely a little bit chilly but the lighting is fantastic it's nice and bright but there's a little bit of cloud coverage so it's like some good diffused light I like been having some issues with uh, my camera reading some of my cards which is literally terrifying like it's just red right now i don't like that at all oh that's not good getting into the new season i definitely need to go uh there we go buy some new memory cards i picked out the places that i'm gonna shoot kind of excited for them because i picked some spots that i haven't actually shot at before i'm gonna use my little fanny pack uh my camera fanny pack for the first time today okay it's gonna be hard to show in the car this cool little leather fanny pack but it holds onto your camera hooks onto the bottom and the side to make it nice and secure and then it has <laughs> this is such a bad review has a little phone case that hooks to it and then you can easily like unhook that so i'm going to swap my phone put it in here that way you can easily get content like as you're shooting um, and I don't have to carry like a big backpack around. So I'm gonna hook like my speaker to this. Honestly, I don't really have anything else I need to bring. Yeah, I use one lens pretty much exclusively. So yeah, that's all I'm gonna bring. I might bring my 
Actually, that's not a bad idea. I wonder if I will bring my uh, little G7X. It might be kind of fun to get some shots with that too, just kind of like mix it up. But yeah, so it hooks just to like the bottom of the camera here. This is like a very heavy setup, so I still like to be like holding it a good amount of the time just because I don't really like all of the weight being like held down especially like with the lens down but still it's nice to have like a nice nice little fanny pack um instead of always having to have like something around my neck that's a little setup i'm gonna put it away for now and uh go over a couple little poses prompts just to kind of refresh my memory and then we will shoot as soon as she gets here I just finished. It's actually pretty cold. <laughs> I think it's still like 30 degrees. I'm fine because I'm wearing a coat, but my poor little senior girl is in like a dress and tank tops and stuff. But uh, she did great. We're all done. It was great. I mean, lighting wise, perfect. I wish it could have been like a little bit warmer and some of the ground is definitely still wet. So it's hard to do any like sitting ones just because it's still kind of muddy in a lot of places. But for the most part, it was great. Gonna head back home. Kind of hungry now. I wish there was a place to stop and get food for my drive home, but I don't think there is. So we're just gonna get back and uh, not really sure what our plan is the rest of the day. Sunday morning we are gonna go to breakfast with a few of DJ's friends and then go shoot an episode of the podcast. I'm hoping I didn't forget anything because we're just gonna go straight to record after breakfast and I felt like we were a little bit rushed this morning. A little bit later, I got a new battery for my camera because the other one died. We finished our podcast and now I'm gonna actually go shoot some pictures for the Special Olympics. Except I'm not really sure where I'm supposed to be. So I think I'm at the right building, but I'm waiting for them to text me back. I'm kind of excited. I am for sure taking like just a few senior pictures of one of the students. And then I think I wanna stay and take pictures of them practicing, but I'm not exactly sure like if I'm allowed to or where I'm supposed to go. This is kind of like an impromptu little shoot that they asked me to do um, just yesterday. It's like 2.15, I'm supposed to be meeting them like right now, but I'm kind of scared I'm at the wrong building. Oh, they're texting me back. I'll let you know how it goes. <laughs> Sight. I'm just kidding. Do you do making fancy din? It's not fancy. It's fancier than I could do. We've got our salad. Tell us what we got here. We have a reverse seared one inch sirloin. Bacon right now, and we're gonna sear it once it gets done. We got some homemade croutons, some salad, mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. Ooh. For me. This is a big ass steak. Oh, you can have steak next for okay. Steak knives, what happened to steak knives? I don't know, I was wondering that too. What's up? Let's vlog a little bit today. It's Monday morning. I am just backing up the pictures that I took this weekend and I'm probably gonna go through, cull them, pick the ones I like the best, and then I won't edit them for a few days because I have other sessions I have to edit. I was just gonna do like a weekend vlog, but I think I'm just gonna extend it through today because as always, I like have no idea how much footage I actually have from this weekend. So yeah, Jaden is sleeping right now. He's right at about that two hour mark, so I would assume he'd wake up any minute and yeah, we have like no place we have to go today So just kind of working around the house hanging out with him. My mom has the day off work So we might hang out with her a little bit. Maybe go to my grandma's see her not really sure Just thought I'd bring you guys along for today and then I'll make this kind of the end of the vlog or I'll make this day the end of the vlog I think I'm gonna make another coffee while this is uploading. I I don't know, I'm probably having way more coffee than I need to, but I did make myself drink a whole thing of water before I had any coffee. But I kind of have been liking starting the day with like a hot coffee, just like ease me into the morning. And then I like 
to make like a cold brew or like a brown sugar oat milk shake and espresso i don't know maybe i will make one of those just while i'm waiting for this to import in my computer yeah and i just feel like i have so much that i want to get done today I, even though i don't like have to leave the house or anything it's kind of my only day to be like at home getting stuff done i will be gone most of the day tomorrow i have a shoot and then a hair appointment and then some errands wednesday appointments thursday potential shoot on friday so i kind of just feel like today's my only day to really be like editing everything that i have to and so i have to edit the podcast youtube video and four sessions and i haven't even started on my taxes yet and i know i have a little bit but it's always such a pain doing my taxes like having a business i just every year i'm so anxious about it i always like to get a head start because i never get it done in one day inevitably there's always something that i forgot or have to go back and, and figure out so i need to like get everything ready for all of that it's crazy because it's not like busy season at all like march is still very much i'm pretty open i have like a lot more time than busy months but i still feel like i have so much that i have to do and it's honestly more like prepping for the busy season so i'm wanting to put together like new wedding handbooks for all of my brides and then i would really like to have handbooks to give to any other session so seniors families anything so that when they book a session they have all the answers there of like what is the best kind of like outfit to wear what are like some locations you can pick from what to like tell your kids ahead of time to help the shoot go smoothly or like what's my process of shooting i just feel like i have a lot of like backup kind of admin work that i have to do and Jaden is a fantastic sleeper but it's i still feel like i just don't have enough hours in a day to get it done because i'm really only working uh in the morning when he's still sleeping during his nap time and when he goes to bed at night we're gonna make a coffee long story short we're gonna make a coffee so we can get through all of this The baby is up and he is helping me edit just a little bit. We are gonna see how long this lasts. But he woke up in a super good mood, which we always like to see. The happiest boy, trying to say mama. Say mama. That was close. Mama. Yeah. Mama. <laughs> <laughs>